right, guys, welcome back to this week's vlog. This week, we're gonna test out the GTR, how fast it is in the 1320 or the quarter mile. We're gonna test the difference between 94 and E85. But before we do that, good old Martin here got me this uh, state-of-the-art ethanol tester, right? Yeah, tester. Yeah, Super tester. I don't know if you guys can see that. State of the art, guys. Put some water in, some ethanol to the line, and it just uh, the proper content. So let's go to our pump, our homemade pump, and then that kind of looks not too good, but we're gonna do the test right now. So let's get started and let's go. Nobody even has a nice seal, eh? Right? So that's. No contaminants in there. This stuff is the legit stuff, guys. Not a drop less and not a drop more. So we gotta be consistent. Oh, 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 I need a little more, a little more, a little more, a little more. Perfect. So we're gonna go to our fill station now. We're gonna fill it up. You know how to use that fill station, Martin? No, you made oh, it. I hope so. I didn't make I it. I didn't make it. You used it already. <laughs> I, I didn't. I'm just going to hand pump it. <laughs> I wouldn't even worry about it. Let's go. Let's go test it out. Dum, 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 dum. There you go. All right. So you're going to unlock it. Be careful. <laughs> it's a big nozzle, dude. Does it fit? Uh -huh. Just barely. Okay, you want me to hold it then? Yeah. Or you got it? Or you got it? Or okay. We'll see. Just don't get gas in my hands. I'm on the wrong side too. <laughs> this is actually tough, eh? Huh? This is actually kind of tough. Well, you know what? Here, hold on. Let me go get our. Dude, I can smell it. It's it's nice and sweet. It does smell like nice and sweet. How much are we put in there? Should we just pump this a little bit in and then we'll fill it up? Okay. That way, it it should be okay. What do you use this for? Uh, it's cleaning soap. It's a little hard at first until you prime it up. I feel a leak. Oh wait 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 wait! I forgot to. Uh, you got it. <laughs> that might help. You gotta vent it. You gotta vent it. I'm gonna like destroy the pressure in this thing. I just put the cap back on just so that stuff doesn't get in. Is it better? Oh, you can see it, <laughs> you can see it pop off. You might want to hold that. Oh, <laughs> 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 If you don't want to get gas all over you. And they, they, what did they say? What's the instructions? Just shake it up after? It says to fill your ethanol right up to the dot black line. You shake it and leave it for five minutes. And then it should all settle, right? Should all settle. ASMR. Perfect, eh? One pump, eh? Well, that's perfect, eh? One pump. <laughs> Who says I don't know what I'm doing? <laughs> oh, it's crazy. One pump. Shake it for whatever. And then leave it for five minutes. Do you remember those shake weights? <laughs> <laughs> Who remembers those shake weights? <laughs> That's really never owned one. Alright guys, so we'll be back in five minutes. 
So for all you guys, especially Americans that have used these kind of testers uh, in the States, is this supposed to take this long or is it just automatically drop down and you can see the ethanol and the water separate? Um, leave a comment below because this is the first time we've ever used it and it's uh, taken a lot longer than anticipated. Um, I've watched some other YouTube videos and it looked like it just dropped right away, but maybe that's just edited. I don't know. Let me know. Comment below, you guys. Man, they're not kidding when they say five minutes. It's still a couple of minutes in and it's still uh, not separated yet. So for this vlog, you guys, I'm going to use the, of course, the Sony, which I'm recording right now, and the suction cup for the in-car footage, and then, of course, the uh, GoPro for... I guess uh, out of the vehicle or side-by-side -side shots and stuff and maybe some exhaust uh, notes we're gonna record that and of course to do the test we're gonna do uh, we're gonna use the drag gear here and connect it to the phone and this will set us the benchmark for what these times are so pretty uh, pretty accurate um, good good stuff and reasonably priced so it's been five minutes already and if you look kind of carefully hopefully it's on camera here there's a clear line that separates the uh, water and the alcohol and uh, the pump is pretty um pretty good close to i would say e 82 83 not bad for the pump um uh, close to e85 so so I'm going to go ahead and uh, put a couple of liters into the GTR here. So I'll pump it. So last night it, I ran it pretty low. Uh, normally I don't like to run it that low on the, uh, on the GTR. I do normally fill it up at quarter tank most of the time. But for this test, I ran it pretty low so that we can get pretty close to E D A five as we can. Uh, so hopefully it works out. So I'm gonna put a couple of liters in just so that we can do this test. And once we're done the first couple pulls, and then swap it out for 94 octane. So I'm gonna do that right now. Orange. Orange. All right, so I'm just waiting for the GoPro to update or finish its updating. And then we're gonna connect the uh, draggy, and then we're almost set to go. Martin's gonna uh, control the handheld footage of the camera, and then uh, let's go for a rip. All right, guys, so we are inside the car now. Uh, I got Martin uh, as my co-pilot today, and uh, we're gonna go out to a remote area in Mexico, and we're gonna check out this uh, what uh, this fuel can do. So E85 first, and uh, I'm gonna give Martin a crash course on how to use this camera, and then we'll go from there. All right, guys. All right, guys, so I'm gonna reset the draggy to zero, and then I'm gonna turn off all the AC and get her ready for uh, our first run. So our first run, we're gonna do just straight up, no launch on E85. Just gonna wait for it to clear up here, you guys, and then uh, we're ready to go. We are ready. Ready, Martin? Good. Just gonna let it open up here and then. Uh... We ran out of space. <laughs> Very close. <laughs> but we gotta do it again, you guys, because we ran out of uh, space before uh, we hit the 1320. So we're gonna do it again. All right guys, so we are back in the shop and today was somewhat of a bust. We did uh, do a couple of poles and it was just way too busy on the uh, on the freeway and, uh, and we ran into a couple of uh, pole poles and we call it quits. <laughs> so to be continued guys, we're gonna do it again. Uh, probably do a nighttime so we see some flames and some pops coming out of the uh, GTR. Uh, we did try to do a couple of like 
uh, out of the car footage, so doing some poles and stuff like that, but I'm not too happy with the footage so far that I looked at, but I'll include it in the into the vlog, but it's not that great. The sound is not as good as I anticipated, but I'll try to figure out how to do, I know, some rolling shots and stuff uh, with better audio. So hope you guys enjoy the video or the vlog this week and found the ethanol tester, content tester useful for all you Canadian guys. And uh, enjoy the long weekend. I hope that you guys enjoy the long weekend by the time this vlog is up. And we'll see you guys. Oh, don't forget, smash that subscribe button. You guys turn on the notification, right? And hopefully uh, you guys are enjoying the content. So we'll see you guys in the next week's vlog. See ya!